Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Jason. This is Old Car Auto Guy. Today we are at Rockwood Park Car Show and today we're going to be getting the old Mopar on the dyno as well as checking out some unique cars. So the first car that I see when I'm walking through here that catches my eye is this Grand Torino. Guys, let's take a close look at this. So guys, we're here and Ed Dow with his Dodge Demon, who is from St. Stephen, is here and tells me that he just got back from a uh, driving racing school where when he bought the car, it was something that Dodge offered to you. It came with the car. So when you buy a Dodge Demon, they're gonna teach you how to drive it. So, or how to race it, I should say. Okay guys, we've got Peter here with his Ford Mustang and there's a little something special about it that gets him 40, sorry, 50 Close miles to the gallon. Yep. Peter, why don't you tell us a little bit about your car? It's a 2013 Mustang V6. Uh, what I've done with it, I've put a, what's called a hydrogen hybrid kit. It turns water back into hydrogen form and we just inject it back to, into the air intake and it mixes itself with the uh, air and fuel to make a cleaner combustion. And the result into that is called really a side effect is a cleaner engine has a lower emissions and better fuel economy. So you've got it here, you've had it on a virtual dyno made about 279 horsepower. You're yeah. going to put it on the dyno again today. Yes, I will. Yeah. What's your goal today? Sweet spot would be 300. It's, it's a nice number that we'd like to hit, but uh, if between 290 and 300, I'd be very happy. I'll, every dyno is different every time, so just uh, just have a, a difference of what it was last year. It was 260 last year, so anything above the, the 280 would be nicer. And well, that's good. So not only is it a nice looking car, guys, it's, it, is a, uh, it is just a V6. However, um, guys are taking these cars, you, if, you, if you follow It's Just a Six on uh, YouTube, yeah. you know, he's making big horsepower with those cars. And even the EcoBoost now exactly, are well yeah. over 300 horsepower. Yeah. So uh, I think it's a pretty neat idea, Peter. Thank you. Uh, thank you for sharing with, uh, with the, my viewers well, your thanks car. For, thanks for having and me. And we'll be sure to try and get you uh, on the dyno. Absolutely. Thank you.
dyno all fired up. We're getting ready to put some cars on it, and the one that just went by was a 240. It is fuel injected, made 280 horsepower. That's pretty good. So here comes Peter with his hydrogen uh, injected or water injected Mustang. Let's see if he can do over 300 horsepower. So this is the fourth run. The first three apparently the uh, chain was wrapped around the emergency brake cable holding it back. So this one is going to be without the emergency brake on. V6 Mustang did 260 horsepower, give or take. I don't know the exact numbers yet, but it seems like today might be a day of disappointment for more than just me. Anyways. So off with one Mustang. We got another one coming on. A V8. It's a 2008 GT, I believe. California special. So we'll see what he does. We are up next for the dyno, so let's get her backed onto the trailer. So we're getting her all strapped down, and uh, hopefully, this time around, we can get the horsepower that we need. There is a crowd starting to gather outside. Over here we've got a uh, what looks like a Regal or a Cutlass that's uh, chugging away pretty good. That'll be up next on the dyno. So let's get ready to rumble. All right, guys, here we go. last year. <laughs> One ninety one at forty five hundred. Oh, yeah. Go again. Okay. something happened didn't read who knows what's going on anyways there's our dyno run for 2019 not the power gains I hope that we'd see but we now know that we've got some work to do so back to the drawing board so we're gonna see if this guy like doubles or triples mine
Okay guys, we managed to track down Jeff and uh, Jeff and his wife Ann are the organizers of this event at Rockwood Park. This is the fifth, fifth year. year yeah. So Jeff, tell me a little bit about the event, why you do it and what, uh, what goes on each year. Well, the reason we do it, I guess, is, is I'm a car guy, been a car guy ever since I was a kid. And uh, we always went to a lot of car shows. And of course, we went to the Atlantic Nationals in Moncton, who's a sponsor of this show. And I always used to say to my wife, why doesn't someone do something at Rockwood Park? It's a great, beautiful venue. So I made the comment one day and she says, well, why don't you do it? So here we are five years later. It's our fifth year. Uh, we usually have anywhere between 300 and 350 cars show up for the day. Um, and all our money goes to local charities here in the city. So it supports the SPCA, the Boys and Girls Club, and the Knights of Columbus. And that's great, Jeff, because there's so many people in southern New Brunswick uh, who are looking to do something just like this. And we couldn't have picked a better day. Oh, no. uh, <laughs> yes yesterday, the temperatures were down in the single digits. Yeah. Today, they were like 15 when we get up. Yeah. So it's a perfect day for that. We've got the dyno. I'm bringing yeah. my car over. We're going to get my car back on okay. the dyno. Hopefully, see some improvement over last year. Right. And so, uh, Jeff, thank you so much for uh, putting on Thanks this event. Out. And uh, guys, stay tuned because we will be doing it again next year. Assuming there is a next year. There will be a next year. All right, guys. <laughs> All right, guys, we're getting ready to head home. We've left the car show. Uh, we figured we'd stop at Mary Brown's Chicken and get some of that. If you're in Canada, I'm not sure if they have it in the States or not, but if you're in Canada and you want a great, awesome alternative to KFC, Mary Brown's, I tell you what, hands down, ain't got nothing on the kernel. Anyways, we're gonna head home. We'll close out this video in a minute. Guys, as I sit here editing this video, I come to the realization, obviously, once again, I forgot to do an outro to let you guys know just really how disappointed I am in uh, the numbers. Um, they say the numbers don't lie, but in this particular case, there's no reason why a small block 360 shouldn't be doing uh, 300 horsepower with the mods that I have on it. So my take on it is that I feel it's being choked. So not enough air, not enough fuel. Is it the intake? Is it the carb? Um, can we not, you know, should we have an electric fuel pump on this thing? I don't know. Let me know in the comment section down below what you guys think might be the issue. And do you agree with me that we should be getting at least 300 horsepower out of this thing? I'm inclined to believe so. Uh, at least 275. I'd have been happy with 250. We didn't even come close to that. But on a more positive note, we did have a little contest going to see who could guess the closest horsepower. And... From the screenshot that you're seeing on the screen right now project late for bingo nailed it right on the head with 218 followed by america bumper to bumper who came in very close at 220 but project late for bingo i'm going to be sending you a old car auto guy t-shirt and a new brunswick license plate out in the mail very soon i'll get a hold of you to let you know that you've won by now you already know it all i ask in return is that you let your viewers know that you've won so guys at this point, we're going to close off this video and let you know that this Thursday, the Car Guy and Six Fan Show will be live on Street Six Fans page. If you head over there right now and subscribe to him and hit that bell notification, you'll get notified when that video goes live. So I hope you can join us. We talk a lot about cars and uh, automotive stuff. It's also a support stream, so you can get in there, meet some other guys who you may not know, check out their channels, and therefore, hopefully, they'll do the same for you guys. Stay focused on the windshield, not the rearview mirror. I love you all. God bless. Let's do it again real soon.